tip of the day, and I, I think we've missed two days of it. So um, I'm sure you're itching for tip of the day. And I think uh, I think today's tip uh, when you when you're on safari, uh, I, I think. It's quite important to bring a camera with you, but nowadays it doesn't mean you have to go out and buy the, the, the most expensive camera. You can get little what we call point and shoots, and those, those are important to have, or nice to have rather, not important. Nice to have to get memories of your safari, but nowadays I suppose you could use your phone or anything like that. But um, I think uh, but the tip I would give is, and I think it's crucial for a safari, is to bring your own binoculars. Binoculars are very, very important, and I've got my pair here. I always carry them around with me. Um, a, a good or decent pair of binoculars, I think, are very important for a safari because often you might get to see a bird or something and or even an animal that might be in an area that it, you just enhance the view a lot more if you've got a good pair of binoculars. So my tip of the day would be, if you're going on safari, get yourself a decent pair of binoculars. You won't regret it, and take them with you. That's uh, that's definitely something, I think, vital on a safari. So that's Byron's tip of the day for today. <laughs> I'm just going